Road to GH will reveal exciting content for the next two weeks from October 7th to October 18th, 2024. First, Brennan entered the hotel, his scrutinizing gaze betraying his suspicion. Throughout his journey from Africa, one thought clung to his mind. Can Holly truly be trusted? He had heard too many fragmented stories, rumors that only deepened his doubts about her. Holly, once an ally in his eyes, now appeared as an enigma. When Holly's door opened, Brennan stood tall, his stern eyes seeming to pierce through any lies. Holly, sitting by the window, wore a calm expression, but her eyes had already glanced at Brennan with guarded caution. Both understood that this meeting was far from a casual conversation. Brennan made no effort to hide his intent to interrogate her, and Holly knew she was under suspicion. Yet what Brennan didn't realize was that Holly harbored similar doubts about him. They were both playing a game with no clear winner in sight. Brennan felt uneasy. He had traveled across continents, facing numerous dangerous situations, but this time the feeling was different. From the moment he heard that Holly had returned from Africa, a dark premonition started to loom over him. He knew Holly couldn't have simply come back without bringing some trouble along. She had a way of attracting complications, and this time was surely no exception. Second, Dante was filled with joy upon learning that Lulu might soon wake up after a long coma. He had waited for this moment with patience and hope, and now that feeling was overwhelming him. The days of worry might finally come to an end, as the doctors reported positive progress in Lulu's condition. Meanwhile, Lucky's test results were nearing the final stages, marking significant progress in his recovery. However, Liz couldn't hide the worry brewing inside her. Although she knew Lucky's surgery was successful, she feared the potential complications that might arise. She was well aware that Lucky's health wasn't entirely stable, and the possibility of him facing long-term consequences after the surgery was ever-present. Liz tried to stay calm in front of everyone, but deep down, the fear for Lucky's health was always there. She didn't want him to endure any more pain, and she knew that recovery wasn't always a smooth process. While the family held hope for a better future, Liz feared that unforeseen complications might overshadow their joy. Third, Diane couldn't stop worrying, even though Robert had repeatedly reassured her that his feelings for her were genuine. He firmly stated that his heart still belonged to her, but Holly's return to Port Charles after a long absence made it hard for Diane to feel at ease. Inside her, an unease brewed about what might happen between Robert and his ex-wife, Holly. Robert would spend time with Holly after his tense encounter with Brennan, and that made Diane even more anxious. She understood that no matter how much time had passed, the relationship between Robert and Holly still carried unpredictable emotions. Diane couldn't shake the fear that seeing Holly again might reignite old feelings Robert once had for his ex-wife. Despite his constant efforts to soothe her, Diane couldn't stop wondering, had those deep emotions truly disappeared, or were they just lying dormant? In Diane's mind, the image of Robert and Holly together stirred more worry. She wasn't just afraid of losing Robert, but also concerned that Holly, with her return, would stir up memories and feelings Robert had tried to forget. Fourth, a potential romance might be brewing as Brad starts to open up to Cody, a big step after the many mistakes he made in the past. Brad had been through a lot, and now he was trying to improve his life, hoping to find himself and make amends for his past. Cody, understanding Brad's desire for change, created a connection between them, and that made Brad feel relieved to have someone who listened and understood. With his experience, Cody not only empathized, but also gave Brad useful advice about love, especially when it came to Lucas. Cody knew that love is a complex journey requiring patience and sincerity, something Brad was trying to achieve. Brad and Lucas had faced many challenges in their relationship, but Lucas's return this time brought no hope. Lucas was cold toward Brad, leaving him even more confused and heartbroken. Even though Lucas no longer showed the same concern, Brad tried to stay strong and continued his process of change. With Cody's support and advice, Brad could find a new path for his heart, even if Lucas was no longer his destination. Cody gradually became someone Brad could rely on, and a new romantic story might be forming between the two marking the beginning of a relationship with the potential to grow in the future. Fifth, 
Sidwell has returned to Port Charles, and this time he brought with him a burning fury and a brutal revenge plan. His anger peaked when he discovered that Holly had stolen his precious diamond, an act Sidwell could never overlook. He had once been an unforgiving man, and now his target wasn't just Holly. Port Charles quickly became a dangerous place as Sidwell moved in the shadows. Not only Holly, but also those around her would face the threat. Jason, always ready to protect his loved ones, would not escape Sidwell's wrath. Sidwell knew Jason was a formidable opponent, but that didn't deter him. Anna, with her sharp, investigative instincts, would also find herself in danger as she stood in Sidwell's way of revenge. Lucky and Lulu, indirectly involved in the situation, were drawn into the whirlpool of danger as well. Holly, while trying to escape Sidwell, now not only had to face her enemy but also protect those she cared about. With all these key characters facing impending peril, Port Charles once again stood on the brink of chaos. Next, after returning from Africa, Anna and Jason had an honest conversation. Both realized that their kiss was merely the result of a fleeting emotional moment, sparked by the tension and danger they had faced together. They were both mature individuals, understanding that not all moments of closeness lead to romance. Jason and Anna, despite their respect and understanding for each other, concluded that they weren't truly compatible for a long-term romantic relationship. Anna, with her steadfast and strong nature, knew that her heart couldn't be easily given to anyone just because of a moment of weakness. Jason, always calm and rational, also realized that their feelings weren't enough to form a deeper bond. They both agreed that there would be no romantic future between them, and this decision didn't affect their professional relationship or the respect they had for each other. However, not long after returning, they faced a new mission, a dangerous task requiring close cooperation. Though there were no romantic feelings, Anna and Jason remained trusted partners. They would continue working together with a common goal, using their skills and experience to face the new challenges ahead. This would be a major test, not just of their courage, but also of the intelligence and strength they both possessed. Finally, Ava is about to face a chaotic confrontation with Christina, and this won't be the first time the two have clashed. The tension between them had been simmering for a long time, but this time the situation would escalate into a fiery showdown. Christina, carrying unresolved emotions and frustrations, wouldn't hesitate to express her anger toward Ava. The two would engage in a heated argument, and the tension between them might even lead to physical conflict. Ava, with her tough and unyielding personality, wouldn't stand idly by under Christina's attack. This confrontation would leave a deep mark, not just because of the tension between Ava and Christina, but also due to the complexity of their relationships with those around them. Their conflict could lead to unforeseen consequences, pushing them into even more dangerous situations as Port Charles becomes a battleground for schemes and revenge. Ava, despite her strength, couldn't escape the danger as Sidwell returned for revenge. With his brutal and calculated nature, Sidwell wouldn't stop until he achieved his goal. Ava might be drawn into the chaos Sidwell was about to bring to Port Charles, especially since she had indirect ties to those standing in the storm of his revenge. Sidwell made no distinction between friend or foe, and anyone connected to Holly or her loved ones could become a target. Ava, with her determination and decisiveness, would have to brace herself for a series of dangerous and tense events ahead.